It's time for another deep dive into the galaxy hole and some more wrestling with the amazingly named Wrestler. <laughs> You'd better believe that the Galaxy Warriors mold and all its variations down the bootleg lines were very popular for knockoff wrestlers. And even this particular Wrestler 2 pack has a bootleg of it. It is hard to say this deep into the Galaxy hole which one's a bootleg of which, though I'm pretty sure this is the first one and these came after. And with this Wrestler 2 pack, Hulk Hogan and the Iron Sheik enter the Galaxy hole. On the card back, we've got Ivan the Snake Man from the Madison Wrestling Champions line facing off against either Big John Studd or Jim Duggan. And in classic Galaxy Hole fashion, we've got bullet points about articulation and accessories the figures come with, which in this case is just the removable championship title belt. And as they both come with one, I guess they're tag champions? You know that Hulk Hogan Iron Sheik tag team? because they are BFFs for life. In an absolutely stunningly lazy move, we've got a complete copy of the Sun Gold Wrestler line for the card back of this two-pack. They've even got all the character names and everything from the Sun Gold line. This of course doesn't make a lot of sense because this bootleg of a knockoff line doesn't come with the same characters or title belts they picture on the back here. Now while they have kept all the names from the Sun Gold Wrestler line and in the exact same order, the portraits of the wrestlers are actually different here. So I guess some of these are supposed to sort of resemble the characters that come in these packs, like CG is now sort of Hogan, maybe, and Mask is maybe the Iron Sheik. Of course, just calling this bald mustache man Mask makes absolutely no sense at this point. It's funny they changed the portraits on the back, but not close enough to actually match the wrestlers that actually come in these packs. It could be because this pack is actually a bootleg of a bootleg that's very likely in the galaxy hole. And on that other Wrestler 2 pack I have, there are portraits on there that more closely resemble the eye patch Sheik and Hogan from this set. Over in the corner, we've got the CE logo and some Spanish, apparently telling us some very important info about these figures as we're supposed to keep this important data. Also, these figures, I guess, are number L338 and 9. On the back of that other Wrestler 2 pack, they have a similar but not the same number scheme, with Iron Sheik being 339 slash 10 and Hogan being 339 slash 11. So here's Iron Sheik and Hogan finally off that card at long last, and there's no marking on these figures at all. So the only thing we have is that Made in China stamp on the card back. I don't know why they gave the Iron Sheik this eye patch or the little tuft of hair on top of his head for that matter. There's absolutely no mistaking that Hogan head though, and this is very much 80s Hogan with a kind of more puffed out roid head. The belts Hogan and Sheik come with are silver with some gold highlights, and that's kind of surprisingly nicely detailed for galaxy hole figures this deep in. These belts are actually kind of better than the original sun gold ones with the sticker on them. There are some rather wonky parts to these figures, like Sheik's right arm is all bumpy with a bunch of defects on it. And the color of their arms and legs don't exactly match their torso and heads. Here's Hogan and Sheik with their wrestling belts removed so you can see that the molded belt on their actual trunks is the blank belt incarnation of the Galaxy Warriors mold. This is the same Galaxy mold variation that we've seen most prominently show up in the combo line. So we can finally have great wrestling matchups like Iron Sheik versus Cornelius and Hulk Hogan versus the Cowardly Lion. One thing that is clear directly comparing these figures though is the ball joints on the legs on the combo figures is much nicer than the ones on these wrestler figures as they are a lot stiffer. Like Hogan's legs don't like to come apart that well. No one spreads the Hulkster's legs! Legs, brother! <laughs> oh shit, it's Rocky 3! I'm gonna get fired for this, brother! 
So the iPad Chic figure is sporting the ringed gauntlets that we've seen quite a few times, but the Hogan figure is actually sporting a new gauntlet variant with a diamond pattern on them. And hey, since this happened, we might as well do it. Here's Hulk Hogan and the Iron Sheik all geared up to be combo galaxy warriors. But now, here's Hogan and Sheik as the original incarnation of everyone's favorite tag team, the two-man power trip! I'm bored of this tag team, brother. I'm gonna betray the Iron Sheik, but I'm still the face, brother! Yeah! I'm the champion! Only me! Only me! Yeah, I'm holding the belt upside down! Oh no! My legs are stuck together! <laughs> While the generic wrestler pack figures are the exact same mold as the blank belt combos, they are slightly cheaper in plastic feel and articulation. Particularly, the ball joint legs don't move as well. They aren't horrible, just kind of a generational drop from those combos. Six. They did modify some of the characters, I suppose, and I'm always happy when we've got some more head sculpts in the galaxy hole. There are quite a few variations of these Wrestler 2 packs, so you can see various states of bootleg Hogan. One version uses the Muscle Warriors non-articulated legs body type and has a more direct ripoff of the Sun Gold wrestling titles. Iron Sheik in this one is also less distorted and looks more like he does on the card back, so this might be the first incarnation of these knockoffs, but I don't know. Five. It is strange and kind of wonderful to have Hulk Hogan and the Iron Sheik enter the galaxy hole, even if Sheik apparently lost an eye doing so. Seven. The card back art is actually pretty nice on these, though one of these is a copy of the other. I like how they just took the Robic repaint from the Madison wrestling line and slapped it on their packaging. These types of wrestling figures were also released individually with no title belts as wrestling champs. These had a similar card back, but this time it included Mr. knock off mania himself. Nine. Again, these are slightly above average in the Galaxy Hole and the Knockoff Wrestling Federation. Six. And the bootleg zones overall is seven! The old Galaxy Warrior knockoff figures make decent wrestlers even this far into the Galaxy Hole. <laughs> Let me tell you something, Unicorna. I walked through the valley of the shadow of death, dude. I have no idea how to respond to that. Hogan, you stole my title belt. I'll break your back and make you humble. Oh shit, save me, Aunt Leslie. Oh jeez, I'm here, Hulk Hogan. It's me, Aunt Leslie, here to save you, buddy. What? Do you think you're doing with that title belt, brother? Oh jeez, Hogan! I was just thinking that we could be tag team champions together! This is why I do the thinking, Ed, brother. You drop that title immediately. I am the champion! The only champion! Wow! Hulk Hogan's attacked his best friend in a fit of rage, yet somehow he's still the face in this situation! I'll make the three count for you, Hogan, because I don't have a spine! One, two, three! Ed, we've been friends for years, brother, but you must die for the glory of Hulkamania! Yeah! I'm the double champion, brother! I did it for the youth center, for all the Hulkamaniacs! Not selfish at all, brother! Be a man, Hulk! Admit where you've gone wrong! Admit that you've betrayed everyone! Oh, yeah! I'll never admit that, Brett Savage! In fact, give me your title belt, too! Ha ha ha! I'm the face! What's Hogan doing? No, the immortal leg drop on his best friend, Randy Savage! I mean, Brett! But he's really Randy Savage! <laughs> One, two, three! Hogan wins! I am professional wrestling, brother! You fans can stick it! But I'm still the face! Yeah! Time to break your back, Hogan, and make you humble, you piece of shit! Oh no! I know you just betrayed me, Hogan, but I'll save you! Get off of him! <laughs> 
Well, Aunt Leslie, even though I just betrayed you, you just proved to all the Hulkamaniacs here that you are a true believer in Hulkamania! Wow, thank you, Hogan, sir. I can't believe this! And since you proved yourself to me and all these Hulkamaniacs, I want to reward you with this title belt! Right to the face! There's only one champion, and it's Hulk Hogan, brother! No, please spare me, Hogan! Oh, the immortal leg drop! One, two, three! This isn't fear! I know I'm not around yet, but Hogan is stealing my spotlight! Get out of here again, Ed! Ah! Triple H, let's have a pose down together! Yeah, we're faces together! Oh, yeah! Oh, just kidding! Leg drop! Leg drop! <laughs> Leg drop! It is possible that I was supposed to be the big show, but my face looks more like Austin, so... What? We should have a match, brother! No! What? Why? I could have beat him! <laughs> I'm just gonna have to leg drop her like Leslie some more. <laughs> it's time for Rambo 3, Hogan. You're gonna have to jump to me. I'm gonna reverse that punch into a leg drop. Yeah! And you know some brother, screw the Planet of the Apes too. I hate you. Body slam, leg drop. You've jumped to Hogan. Hey, Hogan, have you ever thought of trying to be Mr. America? I've thought of one thing since I've seen you, brother, and that's stealing the title! Leg drop! Give me the belt! Give me the belt! Yeah! Dun, 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 dun. Leg dropping everyone! Dun, 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 dun.